morning and welcome to Hodel Fisheries. We're on Upper Bilbo and this is Peg 1, one of 24. They're about 14 metres um, to the far bank. Like I say, it's today um, we got that tail end of that hurricane um, in the Atlantic and uh, well, it's not stopped raining. But yesterday there were some cracking weights um, off this fishery. Uh, peg five and six did exceptionally well. Uh, we're coming up to these in a minute. Here's peg four. So, like I said they're well laid out as well. You've got a, a walkway right round the the bank, and you've got paths leading up to your pegs. Yeah, there's uh, 60 pound come off this peg yesterday, and same again, peg six, 60 odd pound come off this one as well. That's what you're looking at, about 14 meters. The good thing is you can slide your pole back the same length, so you know. You get a couple of rollers, you can, it's really pro, it's well designed this um, fishery. Like I say we've got 24 pegs. And um, well obviously there's 24 pegs on the actual weight. A few of the lads there in the car park. We're not looking at them, we're going to do these. These are getting wider as we come up here. I would say slightly wider, not much wider. It might be me, it's just the way I'm looking at it, but... It's one or two pegs what are actually slightly bigger. I think this is about a metre bigger, but the average is about 14 metres. Coming up to 12. There we go, upper Bilbo. You have got the right you have got the right one. Right, let's have a walk round the back. This looks a belt of this one, peg twelve, corner pegs. I say it's well thought out. It's basically the same um, along this side, but since I'm doing the video and it's showing you the actual entire light, I'm going to walk right around the perimeter. That's a well thought out of. That's, that's lower Bilbo, by the way. It's basically the same. Um, there's a lot of lilies on each. Each um, peg has lily, lilies either to the left or the right of them on, on most of the pegs and bulrushes. Pellet seems to do well on here, so I've been told. Maggot. I say sorry about the jumpy video um, and the huffing and puffing. This is the most walking I've actually done in about three years. But there you go. Uh, 17. 18 did well as well, apparently uh, yesterday. There was a, a, a what do you call it, um, an open match on here yesterday. And there was matches, well match weights um, up to 60 odd pound and they were pretty constant, 40s, 50s. So there's plenty of fish in here. Um, F1 carp, this, actually some. Mixed mix, um, fishery. 
so I've been told. I don't like these boards what are in front of the the plot, although it doesn't matter for me because I've got a canal, I've got the stool with the, uh, the platform on it so it just lifts them over. But yeah, they're a bit, a bit dodger. And uh, you're talking a good two and a half foot off the top of the peg to the water. So you're fishing down onto them. And it's the same on every peg. So we're coming up to the last couple of pegs now. I would say it's averaging 40 metres all the way around really. It's just, it, they look wider in, in certain certain areas but not by much. 23. Twenty four, this looks a <laughs> this looks a flyer. Like I say you've got lilies here down the edge. Yeah. Uh, so there you go folks. Let's completely walk round to peg one again. And I'll go up there and get ready for the draw. We'll be getting here in the next hour or two. So there's 24 to 13 and obviously on this side it's 1 to 12 there we go 1 to 12 right, I'm going to end the video and get out of this bloody rain for 10 minutes I said it's we're going to have this for most of the day. I don't think it'll do too much harm. But there you go, like I said, this is Upper Bilbo on Hull Hull Fisheries and Lower Bilbo, uh, Bilbo. So obviously it's the same, same sort of um, layout and what have you. Bye for now. Hope this video uh, gives you some idea what the water looks like.